Monday. I hope everybody's enjoying their day and is having a blessed, beautiful one. So welcome, welcome back. I am back, of course, so welcome. And um, today, guys, I am here with my Willow twins again. As cute as they are in these little outfits, you know, the month goes by so quick and I just like have one baby that I just changed last night that's in a Halloween um, costume. And I have so many costumes, so I really want to um, apply the costumes to them because I, you know, I have a couple of them. I have a lot of them from last year. And then at the after the holidays, um, I bought a couple more. So, you know, I just like really want to get them into, alf into um, um, Halloween costumes, you know, so that they could, you know, at least put maybe two um, or three before it's over right so anyways guys for those that are new to my channel thank you for stopping by guys um welcome to my channel and i am marisol and uh please um subscribe if you like my videos please subscribe hit the notification button so that you can get notified when i get uh, make a video when i post up a video I try to post one up just about every day. I try my best. <laughs> um, please um, subscribe, hit the notification button, um, share the vi my videos with your friends so that my channel can grow. I'm trying to grow my channels, guys. So, And for those that are, are my faithful watchers, welcome, welcome, welcome. I am back. <laughs> mm. My iced coffee that I said I was gonna stop, right? I'm trying to ooh, bring it into existence. So, I was gonna make this video in my living room today, um, but because um, I was actually set up over there, but then you know, when I decided that I was gonna, oh, he has a little hair in, on his nose. When I decided that I was gonna do the twins first, um, it it would have been very difficult. I, I feel like lately, like the best place for me to um to film is in um sorry guys, my dog. Um it's 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 here in my room. I'm I'm most comfortable on my bed to be honest with you guys. I don't know why. Like I used to be so comfortable to, uh, filming most of my films uh most of my videos were filmed in the um living room but like now I feel a lot more comfortable on my bed. <laughs> and I put this this is my um this is my my blanket that my daughter bought for me. She bought it for me way before Halloween and it says trick or treat on it. And I collect the Indian blankets and this is not an Indian blanket but it's made just just exactly the same. So when I seen it and and it's a really big throw um blanket. But it says trick or treat, so um, I would just wanted to put it here just to give you guys a little bit more Halloweeny feel and vibe. Um, so yeah, guys. So for those that are new, these are my Willow twins. They are full body silicone babies, and they're um, they are prototypes um, by Claire Taylor, Claire Taylor dolls. Um, he is um, prototype number three, and she is prototype number one. And he's asleep, of course, and she's the awake. Um, and these babies are so loved. Yes, they are. And this guy is always so sleepy. Oh, my gosh. He sleeps through everything. So, you know something, guys? Oh, I think he got a long sleep. So, um, I think for him, I brought him one outfit. But for her, I brought two. So I don't know if I'm going to put her into um, whatever. I'm going to... I'm going to change my Skylar baby also. Because I, I have I have three costumes. I have one for him. And you know what I got? Oh, dang. Hmm. I just put up the bag. I have a bag with the costumes and stuff. And I just put it... I mean, it's not a way. It's just I threw it high up. 
Oh my goodness, everybody has hat hair today. Everybody has hat hair. So I'm going to change. You know, I have a lot of little babies. Like I would love to have like really little tiny tiny um Halloween um like costumes, like newborn. I will I wish that I you know I could not find newborn um costumes. And, I, and I've looked like three years in a row, guys. I've looked. And I can't find anything. And even if they have um, like outfits, like Halloween outfits, they never have newborn in New York. I, I, I don't know. I, I just don't find them. But um, I did not get them shoes, guys. That's the thing that I messed up on, not that I'm thinking. I always mess up, right, guys? I gotta get it together. I forgot to bring them shoes. And you know what? I found yesterday taking out all the babies to do the video to show you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed that video yesterday. It was a long video. I found her diaper cover. Lord only knows where his is at. It's in the mess of craziness of clothes and stuff. Okay, guys. So this outfit... I got this outfit brand new. I just I just took it out the pack. I just took it out the pack, right? And this says uh three to six months. But it's kind of like really hard to I think this is three to six months too. Let me see. Hold on a second, guys. Let me see the size of this one. This one says hmm. I think I think it says three to six months too. Let me see. Guys, where are you? This one says zero to six months. So it's basically the same thing. It's basically just the same thing. But I'm gonna put her in this one because I just got this one um brand well they they're both brand new. This one is brand new from the store, and then this one is new from Once Upon a Child. But the whole thing is here. It's a giraffe. This one is a giraffe. This one's cute, right guys? It's a giraffe and it comes like with the striped pants. And the um the pants are in here and the striped shirt and it was nine ninety nine but I got a twenty percent off nine ninety nine so yeah so th that one I had I have that one and then I have this one that's like a cockatoo or something or I was a bird <laughs> it's cute right guys so this one is new from the store and this one says three to six months. And it comes with a white long shirt. And it comes with um black like um stockings. Yeah, so I'm gonna put this one on her. And this guy is gonna wear this one. This one is um new too. So you know a lot of them I bought from Once Upon a Child, which is a store that Guys, wherever you are at, Google Once Upon a Child around your neighborhood because you are going to, you're not going to go just one time. And I'm telling you, it's addictive, like addictive. I have way tons of clothes that of, that I got and from there. It's such a good store. So it's lightly used clothes for very cheap price guys okay you gotta go it's really really a great store so this one comes with it's, it's a panda and it has like the little panda it's black and white and it has um long sleeve and it has a little little <laughs> little tail in the back little brown tail and it comes with the black pants so I'm going to have to stop the video, not right now, but I'm going to um, slip them into this um, outfit and then I'm going to stop the video so I could get them some shoes. So yeah, guys, I usually get um, a lot of my costumes are from Once Upon a Child, but um, I... Um, I usually like get like at the, uh, after, after Halloween, guys, you could go to... Uh, online online i usually do it online i'll go to like um carters or um any 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 clothing store any baby clothing stores um children's place um you could go to any children's online store you could, you know you could go online and um 
you get the costumes for dirt cheap under like un, like five dollars four bucks like that that's that i think this one cost me four dollars because they they go i mean this gonna be big on him guys because you know he is not this size but we're gonna kind of tuck it in like this a little bit and we're gonna make this work right wait i'm tucking it all messed up i'm gonna do a little tucking we're gonna tuck it tuck it in yeah i'm just gonna tuck it in and we're gonna make it work and i think i got like um i'm sure i got jordans or nikes sneakers that are black and white and i'll see what i have for her she has stockings so i'll probably just put her some white shoes or maybe i'll see if i have any colors that are in this outfit for her and this little mat and you know something guys i forgot my water bottle you know i never get it all together just when i think i have everything the brush is there but i don't got no water to brush his hair let me see because everybody got hat hair but his hair might be like i like to wet it a little bit so guys, um, with silicone, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna say this because for, for just those people that have, um, silicone dolls and don't know it, okay, just because it's getting, um, you know, it's getting, um, colder weather. And even if you're like in a, in a, in a, in a warm place, like in a tropical place or some place that is hot and it doesn't get cold or whatever, or even, you know for the future for the summertime it's just like a little tip that i have to tell you guys right because um a friend of mine has a very be beautiful she has beautiful dolls so she has a, a beautiful um silicone dolls and i just um bro uh you know brung brung this um up just like a just like a quick tip i thought she knew about it and she really didn't um but um so I just wanted to like share it with you guys because she really didn't know. So I, I just would like to share it with you guys. These dolls are made of silicone and even in the summertime, I like as soon as it starts getting warm, I right away have my air conditioning on and my whole apartment is cool. Okay, you have to keep these um, silicone dolls in cool in a cool setting okay because the the heat will make their silicone sticky guys i, I mean i don't know if everybody knows that and many uh, maybe uh, many of you know about it but even if you don't have like even if it's hot and you have the your, your silicone dolls in a room and it's warm in there it's not it's not a good thing for you to have you know you should have it, it should be cold it should be as like in the winter time last year my daughter came to stay in my house and so a lot of my silicone dolls are in my um you know i have some silicone dolls in my in my in my room and i have some in um in my living room so i keep my apartment nice and cool so but my room is <laughs> is usually cold and last year my daughter came to stay and she kept complaining that it was way too cold in my room so i'm not saying like a like a refrigerator cold but it was cold you know she wasn't she wanted to like be nice and snuggly warm and i was like you better get under that quilt girl because my silicone dolls are in my room and ain't no heat up in my room because she when I, I stepped out when i came back she had like my room is real real small so when i when i came back home she had the heater going on in my room and if i didn't yell at her like if she was a two-year-old child i was like nope you better go to your house if you're cold because you got your own apartment and i love her but uh no you're in my space so okay guys so yeah so you, you want to try to keep the temperature as cool as possible you know because they get the silicone will get sticky and it'll get tacky attack uh, tacky on you know, you know like it'll get sticky and you know like i haven't like these uh, my dolls I, I i have the powder to powder them um but i really don't need to do that because my babies don't get sticky i try to keep it cool in my apartment 
Okay, guys, look at <laughs> He looks so cute, guys. He looks so cute. I love it. He just needs some shoes. Okay, let's do her now, right? I wanted to, like, kind of put her up front. Okay. Let me, let me put her. Oh, put him right here so you could give your sister some shine light now. Oh, my God. He looks so cute. And now it's her turn. Yep. So we're going to put her these back on tights. Oh, wait. You got socks on. Take your socks off. And I'm going to put these tights on. Yeah, guys. So I just wanted to, like, just tell you guys that just in case. If you really didn't know, because my, I thought my friend knew and she she didn't know, you know. So you have to you have to really keep it cool where it's n not nice and hot. You I, like my apartment is always, especially my my back room. My living room is is more open and um so you know I could it, it's like an open space into the kitchen, so it's like. It's easier for me to control the um the heat, you know, and they uh, it, it, like and if also like let's say like a lot of people have like nurseries and you have cribs or cradles and stuff like that, you know, if you have that up, make sure that it's not um against the heater, you know, because sometimes like in my apartment, I live in a in an apartment, I don't live in a house, so um in my apartment the heat is by the window. And um, last year or the year before, I had a crib and it was by that window and the heat comes up. It rises through, the, you know, the, the heating system is, is right along the, the window. And um, yeah, I had to get rid of the I, I took down the whole crib and, and I moved everything around and yeah, we don't do the, I don't have the crib. I have, now I have them. Um, I, I've moved everything. So, I, I do have, um, you know, like, cradles and stuff like that, bassinets and stuff like that. But I, I, I they're, they're against this wall, so they're not, they're not by that heat. By that heat, I have um, a dresser now, a clothes dress, dresser. I don't have no silicones over there because I, I don't want my dolls to get sticky. And, um... Thank goodness I, I haven't had that problem. Not yet, you know? And I, I pray to God that I don't, but let's see what happens. Nothing in life lasts forever, right? Nothing is forever, but we gotta make it for as long as possible. Yep, so I wanted to make some. I should make her a giraffe, right? Instead of the bird. Hmm, now that I'm into it. So then this way they could have both been like, um, I mean, a bird is an animal too, but, you know, it's okay. She'll get, she'll go into another one and then another outfit. I'll, I'll, I'll change them before Halloween. I'll change them again. Papa, your arm is okay? So his armature, guys, is broken on this arm. This one is good. And I, I don't even want to bend it, to be honest with you, but it's, this one is good. I try not to, like, really mess with the armatures at all. But his armature is broken, and I can feel it inside, like, inside his arm. Yeah. I wish I could get it fixed, but... um. I don't think that Claire will do any, any repair. I think I actually, I think I asked her like years ago when it happened. I, I think um, when I got him, I think like very short after I got him, his armature broke. And it's weird because I really don't mess with their arms. I really don't. I try not to. Because, you know. I just like to dress them and 
I don't really like mess with the armatures. Guys, you know, it's so crazy. You know what I was thinking? Because I put the bag up, but I think I am going to stop the video and I'm going to, <laughs> I'm going to go get an outfit for Ethan. I feel so terrible. My poor Ethan. I love him so much. And I've just been such a terrible mommy to him. And it's not fair. I mean, it wasn't fair to your other, all the other babies when he first came and had all the attention, right? But now he's getting a little bit of his own medicine, bendito. Yeah, I gotta go. I gotta change. I mean, he's in a um. He does have a Halloween outfit, but and I did just to my defense, I did just start yesterday. I'm gonna show you Macy. Oh, um, her outfit. Oh my God, Mama, you're a little birdie. It's big on her, but you know, it's big on them, but it's okay because, like I said, you know, this is um, <laughs> oh my goodness, oh my goodness, she looks stinking cute. Okay, guys, I'm gonna stop the video and I am going to get black and white shoes for her, and I'm gonna find something for her feet as well. And I think I'm going to get a setup for um, Ethan because I'm feeling some kind of way. And I'm going to show you real quick before I forget. I will show you this girl. <laughs> she is a little unicorn, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> yeah, she's a unicorn. She happy. She loves her little outfit. Yeah. Put her right back here. She's on my bed. Okay, guys. So now I'm back. All right, guys. I'll be right back. I got Ethan out. And I wish I could show you my bed because I just made the most biggest mess in the whole universe. Like, it's so bad. So I took out these pink shoes because they match exactly to her outfit. Like, perfect, right? Mm, and then, you know. It has yellow and it has blues. Um, it has white. I took out these white shoes. Right? But after I took both of these out, I discovered these black ones next to me. And I think I'm going to do the black because it'll keep like the whole, you know, black ensemble thing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, I, you know, so I took out three pairs of I took out like six pairs of extra shoes because I'm going to show you in a minute. So I'm going to put these um, glittery ones, but the glitters don't come off because glitter is like fire. Like it's not good on silicone. It's the worst thing ever. Like it sticks on there like crazy glue. It's terrible. I hate the way black. I, black is like, oh shoot. Look at that. I still got the plastic inside. Um... I made, you know, I made a mess. And not only in my, not only on my bed, guys, like, I, I popped open, so I, so I have, like, an abundance of shoes, right? And in my room, I have, oh, my gosh, it's bad. I don't even want to tell you what I have, guys, because, like, just like I said before, like, just the stuff that I have in my apartment, I don't need anything in storage. And I'm over here, like, still wanting to buy and do this. I got to just stop. The addiction is bad. Yeah, I like the black because it keeps the whole ensemble going, you know? And they, they fit nice and comfy. So, for him, I just found him these. They're a little bit dressy, but they got a little bit of white on them. I mean, I have sneakers, too, but I, was, I just seen these and I was like, bingo. These are them, you know? So we're gonna put these on him and then i better hurry up because i think i'm going to change um my wait wait what am i doing what's wrong with me that doesn't go on that foot it goes on this foot papa i moved up the, the okay you can't get me i moved the tripod a little bit so you guys could get yeah definitely they go perfect 
So I opened up the drawer. I have a drawer. I have two drawers, which I'm going to. I'm I'm, I'm gonna get a bin and I'm gonna just try to empty out and make a bin of shoes. I don't know where I'm gonna put the bin, but just so I can free up those two dresses. I have um two. I have two um two drawers on my dresser, and they are full of shoes. And I popped one open. Hmm, I wonder if these snuggles look good because it keeps the whole back. Mm -hmm. And now I can't close it. All these shoes like popped out and big mess. All right. So let me see what I'm going to do because I'm going to nail one of these babies. What's that? Mm -hmm. oh, okay, okay. Guys, we had to put Rocco inside the cage because he was tripping. He was like bugging out. He was in the room with my brother. Papa, you are so... Oh, okay, first of all, before I do that, let me move you over here, right? Oh my God, mommy, you don't love me no more, mama. Why you treat me like that? Why you treat me so like a stepchild now? These new babies come in a nursery. They just took up all my love. They did, mommy. Oh, look, a shoe came off. They're a little bit big, but I like it like that because I don't. They're nice and light. They're not, um, damn, they're falling off. I'm going to put tissue in them. Oh, you know what? I got tissue right here. So I'm going to fix it. I got my quilt under there. Let me see your brother up here. Oh, guys, I have my dollar jumper on. Boop, boop. <laughs> I love these jumpers. Yeah, it's so comfortable. I'm trying, like, the other day I was like, I'm not going to put it on. I'm not going to put it on. I got to switch it up. All right. So, Ethan is going to get... I'm going to take him out of this Halloween, although he looks so stinking cute. We're going to take him out of this one. I'm going to put him on in another one. What's going on with your lip? Hmm? All right. Ethan's going to wear... He's going to be a monster. Is this a monster or a spider? It's a monster. See? He's going to wear this monster. It's blue. It's like... um, It's blue. What kind of blue is this, guys? Because blue comes like in a million colors, right? I was going to say royal blue. Is it royal blue? Or it's like that. It's that bright blue. And it, um, it's a one piece. And it has four arms and the little feet are covered and it has a green tummy with blue dots on it what kind of animal is this this is just a monster i like it because you see you could cover his hands the hands have like it's attached and it has like three fingers and it has a uh, green spots on the shoulder and it has a monster face with three eyes three teeth two horns and horns can have like turquoise blue royal blue um green and it's like striped all the way down repeat repeatedly and it has a zipper in the back so that's how we're gonna put it on him and i got this at once upon a child and they haven't worn it yet so this one look guys so this is what I'm saying. Look at how fly this outfit is. This is a really nice, wait, you can't even see, right? Because of my hand. But look at how nice this is, right? And I only paid 450, but I didn't pay 450 because I, I get 20% off of the 450. Because what happens is every single time I go to Once Upon a Child, I don't know if this applies to all Once Upon a Childs, but the one that I go to, so they have this thing like if you spend a hundred dollars right you get 20 percent off the next time you shop i've never ever ever gone to once upon a child and came out with with under for some reason it's always 166 or 167 or 162 it's always 160 something okay it's always 160 something that's how much i spent and I always get 20% off, 20% off, 20% off since the first time that I shopped. Okay, it's been that way. I always get 20% off. I, like right now, 
I have 20% off waiting for me over there. But I don't want to go because I'm a junkie and I have way too much stuff. So I've been just like really not trying to go. And then I have a lot of things also, guys. I have a lot of things that I have to stay focused. I am not letting um, any of my, um, you know, my situation. Like, I'm not taking it to heart right now. I'm not. I'm just taking the day by day. And God always provides for me. And that I don't feel that there's no need for me to sit here and stress over something that, you know, you can't squeeze water out of a rock so you know it, things will happen and i i'm just so confident because it always does and it's looking good like today was a good day like you know yesterday i was just like so everything is it, everything you know it's today was a, a, a positive news you know like uh i think it was when was it that i went with my daughter just the, just like Thursday or Friday, I was just like, oh, you know, something new occurred. And then I was just like a little bit stressed over it, but not really like stress. I was just like something on something new to worry about. Right. But I don't I don't worry about stuff. I just be like, OK, something new, something added onto my list to do and list to take care of things. I don't worry about it. I'm like, listen, it is what it is. So what happened was. I have two cars and one of my cars, um, they cut the catalytic converter. I said that before to you guys. So that one, I, I'm not even going to, you know, like I found out what it's going to run me. Um, and I will take care of it when I take care of it. That's my older car. So then I have my second car. So guys, I want to put in this onesie, which I don't know if it's going to fit them. It says five to eight pounds. I don't think so. To me, I don't think so. It's a little wrinkle because I have like like a million one like these jammies, and they all like folded up in a bin. So I want to put them this because it it kind of like matches this, you know. It's got like the same colors. So I just wanted to ch change him. So I didn't worry about my car because. You know, it's going to be taken care of for real. Like, for sure, for sure. Right? I don't think this is going to fit him. But we're going to see. If it doesn't, I have another one. And, um... So, I didn't worry about that one. So, I have another car. And then my newer car, which is not brand new, guys. They're both old cars. But, supposedly, was supposed to be my better car, started acting up. And it just didn't have no power. And it was just like, it, it just didn't want to drive. It didn't have no power. And it was just like stressing me out. Because I'm like, dag, now I got two cars and they're both down. Like, I just did maintenance on it or whatever. And it was just, it just wasn't working. But then I see my mechanic. And, um, guys, I, it was it's something really simple. It was like, I was, guys, I was riding driving my car around with absolutely no transmission oil that he was like marisol park the car right now turn it off and you know so it's some special oil that it's supposed it's not regular transmission oil it's as you know just special transmission oil but i thought that it was my transmission was like was gonna um it was um you know messing up because you know if it's your transmission now you got to put in some work or get rid of the car because that's like a lot of thousands of dollars and i'm not going to do that right i got dolls to buy i can't be spending thousands of dollars on my car <laughs> that sounds backwards right no 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 but seriously guys i just i thought it was just i thought it was that i thought it was like my car was really gonna be like done and i was like that oh my gosh these colors look so cute on you papa Oh my god, baby. I'm so sorry. It's a little bit kind of like sh like if if no, it's good. It's good. It's looking good. Sometimes these zippers like right? Like it like but it's alright if it's some good. So anyway, so it's an oil thing, but it was late. I couldn't get the oil. And then today, so my my you know, because I can't I don't have a car to get to buy the oils now, right? So my mechanic was like, I got you. I'll come tomorrow and I'll pick up the oil for you and we'll take care of it. But he likes to gamble. And he was like, I'm going to Atlantic City. And I was like, oh boy, this guy's not going to come around. So, and that's what happened. He didn't come around. And I'm, I hate, 
to rely to have to rely and wait and say I'm, I'm so independent i like to bam boom boom knock it out and do it myself right that's how i roll so guys i have to put his um sneakers on before oh wait oh he got these footy thingies hmm and look i took out three pairs of shoes i took out these felis i took out these nikes and i took out these jordans <laughs> I was like, oh, I know I got blue shoes. These would have, this and this would have been good. But I guess you don't need them. So, anywho, so I'm sitting waiting for my mechanic for two days to like come and help me. You know, he has to pick up the oil for me. And then I called to see, to see how much it was going to be. And it's a little bit costly, but it's not nothing that it's like, oh my God, I can't afford it. You know, I, I got, I got it. And, um, and, but the thing is like the place that I call, I call like three places and uh, they didn't even have like a lot of the oils. None of the places had the amount. They were like, oh, we got to order it. We got to order it. Cause they only had like one or two and you know, cause they say that it's a, type of oil that it's transmission oil guys but it's like you know like a high-end bougie type transmission that's why i don't like like you know like i was i almost got myself into a mercedes benz truck i almost got that because I've, I've i've sat in it and i felt like oh my god luxury like like it was so lavish it was so so fly guys like i felt like <laughs> And yes, this is me, bitches. And then I called my son and I showed it to him on um, FaceTime. My son was like, Ma, you better jump out that car right now. Get out of that car. Get out of that car. And I was like, but I want it. It's so sexy. He was like, Ma, I'm telling you. So he has sent me to the guy because the guy was like a, some dealer guy. And he has some other cars. And then all of a sudden, we just started talking and he showed me that car. Of course, I didn't like the one that I originally went to see. And he wound up showing me that, that car. And my son had the guy's, um, like, number. And I was like, I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it, which I wasn't going to get it because I'm not going to go. You know, my son knows pretty much about cars and stuff like that. So <laughs> he started texting the guy. And he was threatening the guy, guys. It was so hilarious because the guy, the guy and I was laughing. He was like, "Look what your son's writing me." He's like, "I know where you live. I got your information. <laughs> you better not sell my mom that. I'm telling you, you get sell my mom that car." Like my son was like, "Ma," like so I didn't get it. And he was like, "Ma, Mercedes, that Mercedes truck, like the oil change, like tires like this the brakes like any simple thing he was like you was gonna pay buku dollars and he says when they break down they're done he was like they just don't get it he was like don't don't go don't go crazy so i didn't get i didn't get nothing crazy guys i'm not like too when it comes to um oh my goodness i'm smothering you right when it comes to cars, guys, I, I don't, I really, I'm not, like, too, like, bougie and stuff like that when it comes to cars. Like, my car is cute right now, but it's not, like, a really, really expensive car. It's an older model, and, um, you know, it's not crazy. But it's cute because I, I kind of, like, pimped it out. Like, I, I, it's, it's white, and then it, um, I put it, I, like, dressed it up. Like, I put lights. And like on the bottom, the outside, I've got lights in the inside. Um, um, this I put pink seat covers, and oh my goodness, ra ra! I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. It got like it looks like spiders attached. You know, this is big on him too, guys. But you know, like I said. This is, I'm trying my best over here. Let me see. I wish this thing. Oh, oh my goodness. Why are you the cutest in everything, Papa? Why? I love him so much. Oh my gosh. I love him. I love him. I love him. I'm sorry, Papi. I'm going to cuddle with you tonight, I promise you. I'm going to sleep in Mommy's bed. I think I'm going to put him shoes just on top of this. Just to um kind of like bulk this up a little bit. Because you see it's long and... Let me try it. Let me try it real quick. Um, 
And you know, guys, I wanted to change like another. I took out some outfits and some stuff from my other dolls, and I wanted to change. I, I'm, I mean, I'm still gonna do it whether I, I do it with you guys or not. But I wanted to do it with you guys, but um, I don't know. I'd be feeling bad because I've been making five-hour videos, right? Maybe I should have the paper in there for sure. Well, it doesn't matter. He, Ethan has really little feet. Yeah, guys. So my son was, he, my son, that's my, that's my firecracker son. That's my crazy, my crazy son. That must have been some, um, yeah, my son is crazy. He's, he was just like, he was threatening the guy and we were just, he was, he was ringing my phone and I wasn't answering my, my phone. And, um. Then he started texting the guy, and the guy was like, "Look, look, look! He's he's texting me now. He's he was like, look what he's saying, and he was threatening my my, my son was threatening the man. He was like, yo, you better not like I I could just hear him now, like, cause he was like, yo, you better not sell my my mom that that piece of shit car. He was saying he was like, I'm telling you, I know where you at. I was like, we were cracking up. I was like, I'm sorry, my son is just violent. He's just. My son is just, he's crazy. So I think, you know, these are super big, these shoes. They, they're like soft. They're super big, but I think I'm going to leave them on. I mean, I'm, I'm going to leave them on because I think it's going to do the job. Like, I think it's going to take up, like, some space. I know this looks a little crazy, right, guys? But let, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's see if it works. I just wanted to like, you know, because like, you see the way it's just like flappy there. I thought it doesn't matter because, well, it does because I might take them out. I mean, I love taking them out. Oh, yeah. You see, guys? You see? You see the concept? But like, it's, it's filling out the, you see the way? Oh, my goodness. Let me undo my feet because then after a while, I, I just like, I don't know. I'm getting old. I'm getting old. See the way the snow it doesn't have and the band is all the way back here. It's like I mean maybe I could just leave it like that, right? Nobody will know. They'll never know. They're gonna know. How they're gonna know. They'll never know. <laughs> I love that that um that thing on um TikTok. They'll never know. How they're gonna know? They're gonna know. How they're gonna know? They'll never know. They're gonna know. <laughs> They'll never know. Well, I'm gonna know, right? This one has a tissue. Let me take the tissue off. She needs the tissue on her shoe because her shoe's just coming off. She'll lose the shoe in a minute. Right, mamas? Oh my goodness, I love these guys. I love my collection. I love, I love my collection. I really do. And you know what, guys? That video that I did yesterday, it was very, very, like, it took me, it, it did. I, I, I have to stress how long it took me to set that up because it really did um, took, take me a long, it took me a long time. And it took me a long time to put them away as well. But, like, it was nice to, to take them out and to just, see them and, and know what I have you know because I really honestly didn't know like I left I did the whole video and forgot about one of them but it was it was nice to take them out and to just have them all I've never done that I did I did that once before when I had um my Romy dolls I think I had seven Romy's and I had an abundance of Clears. Well, I had all these. I had all these, and um, and I had actually, I I, I had um, I had I I sold I sold a, a clear baby that, I don't know I couldn't bond with her because, the ex mommy for some crazy reason she said that the doll was like missing some hair in the back and she went and she pulled um she sent her to get rerouted, and I just couldn't so. She had, originally she had brown hair, and like that reddish, brownish hair, which is gorgeous, right? And then 
they rewooded her like with very 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 light white white blonde hair and very fine it was not good it just wasn't good i don't care just it just took away from the doll a million percent i feel that even if let's say like i've never experienced any of claire taylor dolls losing hair i've never personally me myself i've never i've never done i've never experienced that if not one strain of hair never oh my god ethan you look so handsome in this little outfit but i feel that if their hair were to come out or if they would have uh, missing hair i would just send them to get hair replaced in that spot where they where they're losing their hair i would not completely get that doll redone and then i was going to because i couldn't bond with her hair and stuff like that so i was gonna actually send her to get rebooted again right and then i decided to ask claire if um that if that was a you know i was like I, you know first of course i asked claire if she could redo her hair right but she, claire doesn't do that because she's very busy you know she can't be fixing dolls right so she couldn't do it so i was like i said well um do you think it's a good idea for me to send her to get rebooted again so she was just like to be honest no it's not a good idea she said the holes are going to be there and um you know it's she said personally i've never done it like that i've never rerouted hair like that and she was like it's silicone i don't think that you should do it i got him this little but i thought it was a i thought it was this type of but he's a monster he don't want that right now it's not gonna look good what's gonna look good is the rattle that i have somewhere over here so i want to change this big girl because she is she's a reborn she is the Marco kid and i so love uh this girl i love her right and i wanted to change her outfit and then i got some outfits from for those reborns but i am not going to drag this video 99 hours guys because if not i'll be here talking to you guys and making this video super long and i have such a mess on my bed holy camoli this is not of god i tell you where is my rattle over here bro? why are you staying on it fat girl there we go you want that rattle papa you can't get it because you got the monster hands you got the monster hands you can't get it look into my rattle <laughs> All right, guys, so that's all I'm going to do for today. I did three, and I think this video is pretty long. Yeah, it's like almost an hour, I think. Okay, guys, that's my three babies. Let me take, let me try to take it off the tripod without, holy crap. What a mess. I, let, me, let me move all my junk over here because you guys are going to see my mess. I'm a little bit, gosh, this is not right. I don't know. I always make a mess when I when I do like when I change my my dolls. It's like I'm trying to conquer not making a mess when I am changing my dolls. That's that's my goal in life. Let me see if I could take without. Oh, okay. So now I don't know if I can't really. All right, guys. So this is Ethan. Can you guys see? Cause I don't have it the opposite way. So let me see. This is Mommy Ethan, and he says to you guys, check a tree, smell my feet, give me something good to eat. I am a monster. I'm Ethan the monster, and I'm going to get you. Say, rah. Say, rah. Right? So we got this one. This is my beautiful little pelican. I'm a, wait, can you see her? No, right there. I'm a pelican. Say, baka, baka. She a bird, right? And then, I don't know if you guys can see because I can't see. And then we got this guy over here. He's so sleepy. He slept through the whole entire changing. Why are you always sleeping? Here we go, guys. 
That's my three babies. They're so cute, right, guys? All right, guys. So that's it for my video. Oh my gosh. Ugh. That's it for my video. And I'm gonna end my video with, keep God first, say a prayer, be grateful, be thankful for every single thing in your life. For the air in your lungs, for the water in your skin, for the food in your, tum in your stomach, be thankful be grateful always keep god first always be thankful don't be like i don't have this i have problems i don't have no money i don't have no this i don't have no that think about the things that you do have you have another day on this planet you have air in your lungs you're healthy and even if you have health issues you're alive you're healthy enough to watch my videos if you healthy enough to watch my videos, you better be thanking God that you can sit there and watch a video, okay? And be thankful, be grateful, say a prayer, um, keep God first always, and be kind to one another, guys. Say something kind to somebody, you know? Try to say, make it your goal to say something, give somebody a compliment. Even if it's one compliment a day. You know, try to do that because, you know, compliments make people feel, you know, and, and let it be a genuine, a genuine compliment. Don't just give somebody a compliment just because you're just trying to, you know, if, you know, just, you know, if you see somebody has a beautiful shoes, a beautiful bag, a beautiful coat, a beautiful person, you just, oh, you're so beautiful. I, you know, like if you see somebody that's beautiful, give them a compliment, you know, um, and just, just be kind to one another, guys. Just be kind. Try to be helpful to one another and be kind to one another. And um, that's it. Stay safe, guys. Hand sanitize. Um, you know, remember COVID is still out there. And um, just be wash your hands as much as you can, guys. You know, hand sanitize always. Use your mask. Try to keep away from people because, you know, people be having cooties and we don't have, we don't want cooties. So that being said, God bless you all. Have a beautiful evening, guys, or a beautiful morning. I don't know if you could be on the other side of the world. Just have a beautiful, wonderful day. Okay. Be blessed. Don't focus on negativity or anything negative that's happening. Just, you know what? Something's messed up. Don't worry about it. It'll get fixed eventually. Because you worrying about it, it's not going to make the problem go away, okay? Eventually, with time, things will work out. All right, guys. Bye. Guys, they say, happy Halloween. <laughs> guys, you want to see my mask? Look at my mask. You see the mask? Ah! And then I got all these babies I want to change. All right, guys. <laughs> I shed my mess. Bye, guys. Love you.